Is anybody gonna come? Is anybody gonna come? What's up guys, this is Cody and welcome back to another episode of The Infected. How's everybody doing today? Today I am doing fine and look at this, our noise value is at 9.301. Ooh. So guys, I've done a little bit of work off camera. Let me tell you guys what I've done since the last episode. So the last episode, well, let's move this out of here because this was for screenshot. <laughs> so let's put this back right. Uh -huh. Like I saw, yes, all. So I went ahead and built the circular saw bench. I've done, a, <clears throat> I guess, some additional work. Uh, well, not really a whole lot of work on the main base. We went ahead and got this clay extractor. I don't remember if I did this on camera or not. Um, but I know what I did do off camera was kind of do this little fishing deck out here and as uh, you can see that, <laughs> and I went ahead and built this up. So went ahead and, because I wanted to try to go ahead and get some of this stuff done. So as you could probably tell, this is probably, or not probably is definitely what we're going to be focusing on in today's episode. We're going to try to get at least a couple of these wind turbines, a couple of solar panels the control panel and the junction box why are we trying to do that well it's very very simple <clears throat> we need to go ahead and i think it's going to be over here we need to start where's this thing at we need to start is it the oil oh my god i think it is the oil extractor yeah we need to start getting the oil extractor that's for sure realistically <clears throat> if we can go ahead and get like a couple of these oil extractors and one of these stone grinders if we can get 200 power guys that's what i would love to do that in today's episode i don't know if that's what's going to be done but i know we could get it done at least in two episodes um so that's definitely what we're going to be trying to do we need to get up on this barn too soon like asap real soon um but we're trying to get um some other things taken care of like functionality in the base actually next episode um, I'll go ahead and give you guys a sneak peek. Along with working more on the power side, we're going to start looking at some defensibility uh, things of the base. So we got to start putting some spikes, some barbed wire fence. Which, by the way, this is super expensive. So I don't. This is like next level tier type stuff. So like the beginning of base defenses is going to be my spike traps and the wooden fences. We could probably. I don't know if we'll be able to get to some of that this episode or not, but I know we need to start doing that. I know we typically, except for that one last time we died, we've been holding our own on the on these raids that we've been getting or these horde days, whatever the heck you want to freaking call them. We've been doing quite well, especially since we got the steel spear, right? But here's the thing. I would rather us just go knocking on, <laughs> knocking on about our day and moving and progressing and not have to worry about these attacks each and every time they come. We could just let the base defenses take care of that. So, yeah. Um, I went ahead and moved one of these in mineral extractors over in the cave. So now we have three of these mineral extractors over there. Um, we also need to look at and I don't know if we'll be able to get to this in today's episode. We got to start moving some of this stuff around, rearranging this area, because obviously this area is going to be like a uh, like a workshop area, an outside workshop, if you will. Because last season we did everything internal, like we had a workshop base or not workshop base, but everything was like internal or well, except for the forges. We actually had three forges. But anyways, this is going to be uh, kind of like a continually um growing and upgrading type situation along with the fishing dock so um i would like to do all this melting stuff like outdoors if you will in this uh in this season and then you know have our main base up there um maybe crafting i i don't know i, I don't know i haven't entirely planned this part of the base out in my head anyways guys so let's see what we need for these things right here all right so like i said sorry <laughs> I had to take care of something. Anyways, so let's take a look at what these things are going to take. So the wind time, wind turbine takes uh, four iron ingots, ten aluminum ingots, which I think we have a few of these already. Lead ingots of five. Um, <laughs> lead ingots of five. Cobalt ingots. Um, so over here, it only takes five aluminum. I think what the, what the holdback really for us right now is going to be our 
iron production because I've completely shut everything off. So we probably, well, there's no probably to it. We need to go ahead and get these things up and going off uh, like we did before. So we just kind of got to keep uh, uh, mindful uh, or aware of these things right here continually going and moving forward. So I'm going to get some of that stuff taken care of off camera and I will be back. All right, guys, so let me show you what I've been doing off camera. Went ahead and got a few things situated. I've got um, everything but the steel ingot shelf done. So this is the lead, cobalt, aluminum, copper, and iron. Um, and then, let's see, this clay extractor is off, obviously, because if you look at our noise thing, we need to leave that long. Um, so this is this is a mix. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. You know what? We're going to go ahead and do this right here again real quick, too. Um, is that done? Wait, what? Oh, this is done. Okay, I was about to say, dudes. All right, let's go ahead and just do this real quick because we got to keep the iron flowing because iron is going to be a thing. With, well, it's always a thing in this game. So, wait. Yeah, right click. And, oh, dude, we're almost overweight. That's crazy sauce. <clears throat> we could probably go ahead and start. Let's go ahead and just dump these real quick. Mm -hmm. And, oh man, so we actually overflowed already. So let's go ahead and dump these in here. So that's one. Okay. Uh, what I want to do before we go ahead and move forward with the construction of these things, um, the power stuff, is I want to, I think as it sets right now, we have, we have a few things on our stuff. Oh, oh man, our body armor is already like hurting. Um, I want to go ahead and get the leg armor and the boots if we can. I think we can. I think it's going to take. I'm pretty sure it's going to take Kevlar and cloth. Where's the Kevlar at? Okay, I thought the Kevlar was right there. Is that iron right there? No, that's steel and bricks. Um, and then cloth. And let's see. What is it going to take? So we need to do the boots. Uh, cloth and uh, make it a baby and then we need to do the leg protection as well this will further protect ourselves um, from the crazy baddies now we can put this stuff back up because we don't need it any longer I guess until we have to construct um, additional armor because I don't think to my knowledge I don't think there is a way to go ahead and um, do we need no we're good to go let's do a little bit of drink job real quick I guess Hello? Wait. Dang, bro. And do that. Yeah, I'm not sure what the heck was going on with my thing. All right, so what we so we need iron, aluminum, lead, and cobalt. So, um, let's just take all the iron for right now. Let's just see, make sure we don't get encumbered, and then just dump all the iron we can in each and every one of these things. And like a boss, and then like a boss. That should be good enough. I know we're going to need iron in here, so dump iron in here and dump iron in here. And do we have leftovers? Oh, yes, we have one. We have absolutely one. That's great. Amazing sauce. Man, what the frick? Yes. 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 Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Baby. We don't have any extra there. And I know we needed cobalt, and I know we needed lead. So, okay. Ooh, we almost got it. So that's one. Oh, oh, we don't really take lead. We just need cobalt. Okay, so what do... Oh, we need aluminum from that. Okay, that's what's up. So no more cooking of the lead. Okay, so we just need other things. What what, <laughs> what was it that we actually need? I know we needed aluminum. So aluminum, aluminum, aluminum and cobalt is what it looks like. Okay, we can do this. We're great. We're, we're great at this game. Aluminum and cobalt, it, not an issue. See, I mean, look at all that right there, baby. Mmm. All right, so we should be able to go ahead and finish up the rest of these, I think, now. Oh, my goodness. Yes, and... Wait, what the crap? Oh, cobalt. One, two, and three. Booyah. Ha, ha, ha. So what do we need for this? Uh, Copper, cobalt, and screws. Uh, Oh. Oh, I have... Okay. I do need the screws. I think I have a lot of screws over here. Uh... I have 33. The, that sounds like a lot, but trust me, bro. 
That will go fast, as you can tell. So we have 81 power coming in. Our power capacity, great, fantastic. That's a lot. Eight. <laughs> what do we need in here? So, And we need one additional iron ingot, which we have. And like a boss. Let's see. So this, this um, I guess you want to call this a power index, if you will. <clears throat> Shows you the number of solar panels, wind turbines, and batteries. If you have some, we don't have any as of right now. And... According to the wiki notes or the, the update notes, the he has introduced wind values now in the game. So this does not provide a constant power uh, like he did in previous versions of the game. Um, that being said, I want to say that the previous power output of the wind turbines was 20 per and it was a constant. If I'm not mistaken, it has been up to 40 per. But it's a variable. This number is a variable now. So as you can say, see, with the uh, with the, with the change of the wind, the change of the power. Does that make sense? So I want to say these also give you forty per. If I'm not mistaken, let's just take a look at that real quick. Is there a way to actually see? So power. Oh yeah. So generates forty power at its peak. So the wind turbines or the solar panels or at its peak or 40 per we have two so that's 80 and this does not give you anything amount of power generated depends on the wind strength i thought it was a max of 40 is that not a thing then well as you can see the power is going down because of the solar panels but the wind is kind of saying to constant is giving us 15 per um i don't know what's going to be the best thing to power the base with right now that being said if you can get 40 out of these um, at any given time, that's 40, 40, 80, 80, 160. We could actually run a machine now. And what machine would I would love to run? Um, that would be, uh, oh, come on. What am I looking at? Workbench, no others. <clears throat> the oil extractor. So uh, to get the oil extractor, you need 20 screws, steel ingots. So six steel, 15 aluminum, and six mechanical parts. I see that. Oh, stop it. Yes, like a boss. So. Oh, no, we're one screw short. I think you make screws with copper, right? Yeah, it's almost time to sleep. Um, anyways. Oh, man, our light value has been creeping up. Has Yes, it has. So. I would really love to go ahead and get the. Um, uh, at least the oil extractor. Why do we need the oil extractor? Well, we need the oil extractor for plastic. We need plastic for the truck. So all of this power and all of the um, oil extractor that we're trying to go for today is so we can try to make a beeline for that truck because we found the truck a couple episodes, two, three episodes ago or something like that. And I would love to go ahead and get that thing um, so we can have uh, that in our arsenal, if you will. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so let's go ahead and continue with the things that we have here. What should we go ahead and keep smelting up? I would say, ooh, we're out of aluminum. Let's go ahead. I don't, let's go ahead and just do the cobalt right here real quick. Go ahead and just keep all this stuff. I, from what I have found, and this is my experience, we tend to get a lot of this cobalt. And, oh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more copper, like a boss. <clears throat> I don't know what the, uh, I guess the difference or the percentage of chance that you get the materials in the cave. Is it an equal chance for every material that you get that the copper, the cobalt, the aluminum, is that the only ones? Let me make sure. Copper, cobalt, aluminum. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I, so I don't know if it's an equal chance. Oh, it's getting dark. It's getting real dark. Or if 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 you can get one of the one of the ores over the other, uh, it's getting nighttime. I'm trying to get some more d work done off camera, and uh, maybe there'll be a little bit more progression um, before we get to. Like I said, I'm trying to make a beeline of get more power, and um, maybe two oil extractors up and going, and we're getting ready to have an attack, possibly even two.
So one thing we probably need to go ahead and set up for is, mm, yeah, this over here. We need to start setting up a, a area or, a, uh, let's see here. What's the best word? I guess a storage. Oh my God. I don't like how that's doing. And let's do that. And then let's do that. Go ahead and put in away the materials needed for the truck. So it says we need uh, 25 plastic, 20 steel, 20 iron, and 15 mechanical parts. So let's see. We have the mechanical parts in there, the mechanical parts in there. It is. Um, so it's 20. Boop. We have 19 plastic. How many? mechanical parts so we need mechanical parts and steel ingots how many steel ingots do we have left in here six and six um if we go ahead we could probably go ahead and get one of these going so one hold up one two three four five and six did we already put all these in here we did so yes we do have one of these going we're just going to leave that as is um how many steel ingots was it it's 20 so one and two Yeesh. Probably, I tell you what, probably, it'd probably be better if we just set them both up out here for right now. I kind of want it in an area to where we could see. So let's put that there. And then let's put this over here. And right there. All right. So what did it say now? So it said 20 steel ingots, which is probably going to take up that entire chest. Um, 25 plastic. We have 19. There is. Um, 15 me mechanical parts and then 20. Oh my God, dude. Like, this is crazy sauce. There's so much stuff. A lot of the stuff we could probably take with us, but we'll, what we'll have to do is take, obviously, um, two, um, I don't know. We might be, a, mm, I think we'll have to take one of these carts with two additional, uh, a storage crate. And then obviously our inventory here. Um, all right. So let's see, let's do this one more time. 15 mechanical parts, 20 iron ingots and 20 steel ingots and then 25 plastic oh that is what i'm hoping to do or at least get most of that done today as i figured we do have um 160 power in so it, what we could probably do is go ahead and make um let's see here probably one two three four five six seven and eight Let's go ahead and do this. Probably going to get an attack, but I mean, that's fine. That's fine. And there's two additional uh, aluminum ingots in there is, or aluminum metal in there. Um, I don't have anything in the mines. I've already tried to get as much as I possibly could. Let's go ahead and... No, let's just leave that blank for right now. As you can see, our noise and light values get ready to peak, but I think the only thing that's going up right now is our light value. Uh, Yeah. Do I have it? I think I have some iron over here. So I think it's like one iron and one stick for, oh, we're getting hot. I need to make some, um, some cooling materials. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh no. Let's put one of these back. Um, uh, we need to make the upgrade tool so we can hook up some wire to the things, uh, to the oil extractors there and make it a baby. Wait, what's, what's going on here? Oh, I don't have a weapon slot open. Um, Let's put this. I don't really see once you get to a point, you don't really use the pickaxe that much. So that could be one weapon that you guys could always kind of like put up. Okay. So we have that. Let's look at, I'll tell you what, we probably got to make some of these things. So some cloth. Yeesh. So we need to make some cool, a cooling shirt and some cooling pants. So that's that. Wait, let's make sure that this is going to give us a cool job. First of all. It's getting hot as Hades. It's 95 degrees outside. So yeah, minus four heat. And then um, I think the cooling shirt is minus 10 heat. Yes, like a boss. And then we can put the rest up. We're amazing at this game. Look how good we are. <laughs> that should take care of everything because we have on all this armor. You know what? We could probably take this helmet off too because I'm sure that does not do any kind of justice for us. And then put this bad boy right here back on. Because this gives us sun resistance. Yeah. We're amazing. We're good. Amazing. 
Lee Good. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and I guess make this fire go out. Uh, what do we need that for? What is this again? This is iron and aluminum. Oh man, it's, it just takes so much stuff to get going in this game, especially. Let's go ahead and take these upgrade tool, and we could probably go ahead. This is really going to not be good for us. You know what? This is just going to have to do it. So put that right here and then put this right here. I know this is going to be ugly for right now, but you know what? It is what it is. And let's go ahead and put that up. And this should be running now. Yes, like a boss. And this is our oil extractor. Um, Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and put all these things up like a so. Then the aluminum. Let's go ahead and put two more aluminum for this one. And then we only need six more aluminum. And that would be both of these oil extractors yeah oil extractors up all right guys so we're getting ready to get an attack and i think we're going to call it an episode because i feel like we have done a lot of stuff in this episode oh okay here we go so we should have all the body armor that we need except for we may lose our chest plate um which is fine we can always make another one which makes getting kevlar making kevlar and cloth a thing in this game as it pretty much was not in previous versions i didn't realize how thirsty i was do a little drink job thank you very much oh yes and yes we should be good to go um so there has been one time hello <laughs> one time that i have not gotten attacked when one of these values the noise out value of the light value has been um reset or maxed out however you want to put it but, and I don't remember how often these things actually, like how long it actually takes after. You know what? Let me change this. Epic, baby. Got to keep the epic. Um, I don't know what the time frame after it resets that you will or will not get an attack. Like, is there a time frame as to when that actually happens? I don't know. This rain sucks, though. I know that. Is anybody going to come? Is anybody going to come? And I think right before we let the episode uh, expire as well, we'll probably go back up in the cave and see what those mineral extractors have uh, accumulated. I don't think we're going to get anything. Well, you know what? It's fine. I love this. What like? What is the percentage of you getting attacked whenever um, these values actually max out? I don't know, but I'm going to leave it be. Yeah. Okay, well, let's just run over here real quick. You guys suck anyways. <laughs> Your mama sucks butthole. Is there anything in here? No, let's go ahead and get on this. I love taking this thing. There's really no reason for me to take. Give me that cucumber. Oh, stop it. Stop it. There's really no reason for me to even take <laughs> the ATV up to the mine. But you know what? There's going to be a time very here in the new, near, near future, maybe even next episode or the next episode, that we won't be using this thing any longer. Uh-huh. And we needed six pieces of... Oh, so that's only two. Crap, that's only four. You know, it's fine. So we need only need two additional... Um, pieces of aluminum to get that second oil extractor going <clears throat> so i think the thing that we're going to continue working on next episode along with getting oh haha, look at that power slide baby we're amazing i knew it I did that on purpose okay <laughs> no i didn't i did i seriously dude you had the worst breaks in the world can you stop thank you jesus um so we did get this. We got the oil extracted done. We got the uh, ingot shelves going. We got the power going. Oh my gosh, guys. We got a lot of stuff actually going in this episode. Let me, you know, I guess we can go ahead and turn back on this thing too. Because I wanted to, to go ahead and um, get that, get our base kind of, in a sense, a, a, in a place where we could actually sleep, sleep so we could start working on, you know, like, our first expansion already. I already have an expansion plan and I haven't even finished anything on it 
<laughs> that's just me but anyways guys I, I think that's going to be it for me in today's episode if you enjoyed it make sure you hit the thumbs up button and if you're new to the channel feel free to subscribe and as always guys i'll catch you in the next episode peace out